unbelievable facts about our universe. We've barely begun to explore our oceans here on Earth, so you can only imagine what's out there in deep, dark space. But what we have discovered about the final frontier, we're bringing to you today in Unbelievable Facts About Our Universe. But before we get into today's video, make sure that you're subscribed and ring the bell so that you never miss any of our upcoming videos. Space Invader 99.999, okay, you get the picture, percent of ordinary matter is just empty space. If you removed all the space in our atoms, the entire human race would fit comfortably into the volume of a regular sugar cube. Say cheese. We can credit the Hubble telescope for providing some of the most incredible images of the universe. Developed by NASA, some of the images that this highly advanced piece of equipment has captured are over 13 billion years old. We are literally viewing something that took place in the past around 400 to 800 million years after the Big Bang. Just a number. This might make you feel rather small and insignificant, but scientists believe there are hundreds of billions of galaxies in the universe that we're just unable to see. Each of these galaxies will have billions of stars, with those in the know stating we have 10 billion trillion stars, basically more stars than grains of sand on Earth. From a distance. Don't go belting out a Bette Midler song now, but did you know that every year the moon moves a little further away from Earth? It's only 3.8 centimeters or one and a half inches, but within a few billion years, our Earth will probably be very unstable or not even be around. In the dark. There's so much we don't know about dark matter, but it's believed that this mysterious matter occupies around 23% of the universe. It has a mass, yet we can't see it, and scientists are aware of it only because of the gravitational pull it exerts on regular matter. Whether it's hot, cold, or warm is still open for debate. Leftovers. Remember those old television sets that would sometimes show static if you were tuning your set into different stations? That is cosmic background radiation, and it's a tiny bit of static that's part of the afterglow of the Big Bang. Not all the static, though. It's guessed around 1% of it is basically the afterglow of creation. Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds in Centaurus, there is a diamond the size of a planet. It's a lump of crystallized diamond named BPM 37093, located 50 light years away in Centaurus. It was nicknamed Lucy after the Beatles hit single, but just know the Beatles song had nothing to do with an actual diamond in the sky, but was said to be inspired by a nursery school drawing done by Lennon's son. The diamond is said to weigh 10 billion trillion trillion carats. Project A119. Also called a study of lunar research flights, this 1950s top secret mission involved the idea of launching a nuclear missile to the moon. The mission was canceled in 1959 because the United States Air Force were worried about negative public reactions. The aim was to be one step ahead in the space race, but it's a good thing that this bad idea never came to fruition a real heavyweight. The sun is a force to be reckoned with because it makes up 99% of the mass of the solar system. It is 190 times the diameter of Earth, and there's enough room on the sun for a million other planets. Leave a mark. When the first footprint was left on the moon 50 years ago, nobody would have guessed it would still be there decades later, and it will probably be there for another million years or so. The reason is that the moon has no atmosphere, so there's nothing that will sweep away the mark. No wind, rain, or people for that matter. Drinks on me. Sagittarius B is one big cloud of gas and dust hovering close to the center of the Milky Way, roughly 26,000 light years from Earth. Inside the ball of gas is 10 billion, billion, billion liters of alcohol. Perfect place to open a bar, it's just a pity it's so far away. Makes you wonder why people are trying to get to Mars where this would be the perfect place to settle. And if things go wrong, you could just drown your sorrows, right? It's vinyl alcohol, and it's providing researchers with a lot of information about the formation of complex organic compounds in interstellar space just an illusion. It's a common misconception that when the moon is directly over the horizon, it looks like it's rather close and so much bigger. This is actually called the Ponzo illusion, whereby your brain inflates the size of something. Mario Ponzo, an Italian psychologist, explains it as the mind judging an object's size based on its background. Born this way. Every day, around 275 million new stars are born. It works out to around 100 billion new stars cropping up every year. Explosive fact. 
When a gigantic star explodes, the scrunched up form of the star is called a neutron star. These stars are so dense that one teaspoon of the material would be as heavy as Mount Everest. When it explodes, the neutron star can spin at incredible speeds of up to 600 spins per second. Moving slowly. The Earth and planets orbit around our Sun. That's common knowledge. But did you know that the Sun is also orbiting? It is moving around the center of our galaxy and will take the Sun 225 million years to make a full rotation around the galaxy. The last time the Sun was where it was today was when the supercontinent Pangaea was breaking apart and dinosaurs started coming out to play. Take a shot. All the astronauts that have spent time on the Moon claim it smells like gunpowder and is extremely soft. Why it smells like gunpowder is a mystery to scientists, because even with the samples being taken from the moon, there is nothing they've found that should give it the smell. The samples of moon dust have been mainly made up of small shards of silicon dioxide glass. Keep your distance. The Voyager 1 spacecraft is the most distant human-made object from Earth. It's been doing the rounds in space since 1977 and to date is still collecting data. Move mountains. The biggest mountain in our solar system is found on Mars, called Olympus Mons. It's a gigantic shield volcano, quite like the ones found in Hawaii, and it's roughly three times the size of Mount Everest. Life support. It's believed there are up to 500 million planets that could possibly support life in our galaxy. Researchers looking for other life forms focus on Goldilocks planets, which are planets that are in a star's habitable zone. Earth obviously has perfect conditions, but many believe we are not the only planet with these perfect conditions. There are thought to be 500 million possible Goldilocks planets just in the Milky Way, so you can imagine that the numbers could be staggering around the universe. Day and night. The strangest fact about Venus is that one day is longer than its year. Because the planet is so close to the sun, a year goes by very quickly. A day is the time we spend between two sunrises or sunsets. Sunrises and sunsets are caused by the spin of a planet, but Venus is a weird one. It spins very slowly. One spin takes 243 days, which is longer than a Venus year, 224 days. Come dine with me. The center of our galaxy has a smell and a taste, both of which get a general thumbs up. Studies on the dust from the center of the galaxy suggest that the amino acids present cause it to smell like rum and taste like raspberries. Now, did someone taste the dust? We can neither confirm nor deny that. Ashes to ashes, dust to dust, it's said that we are all made up of stardust. Everything found on Earth was initially created in the burning core of a star, which includes you and me. Sounds of silence. Space is a very quiet place. There is no atmosphere, so there is no medium for the sound to travel through to be heard. Fortunately, radio waves can be heard, which is why astronauts use radio to communicate with each other in space. It's a floater. Saturn is a pretty big planet, but if you were to put it in a gigantic glass of water, it would float. The density of Saturn is 0.687 grams per centimeter cubed, and water is 0.998 grams per centimeter cubed. Realistically, we would never see this in real life because we would need a glass of water that stretched 120,000 kilometers in diameter. Slow down. The Earth's rotation has been slowing down without us even realizing it. It shortens about 17 milliseconds in a century meaning that every 10 years, our days are two milliseconds longer. The spot. The red spot on Jupiter has been shrinking. It is a giant storm that's been spinning on Jupiter for 340 years, and after all this time, it's finally getting smaller. The red spot is so big, actually, that it can be viewed with telescopes and was probably first spotted by Cassini, who described it in 1665 stuck together. If two pieces of metal come together in outer space and touch, they get welded together straight away. Welding usually needs heat to work, but because of the vacuum of space, no heat is required. You might be wondering how space shuttles don't run into any problems, but that's because these types of metals are covered with an oxidized material, which prevents this from happening. You spin me right round. Our Milky Way is currently rotating at 250 kilometers per second or 155 miles per second. It takes 200 million years for it to complete a full rotation. Eat out. 
Cannibalism in space is a real thing, and it's called galactic cannibalism. It's basically one galaxy eating another. Or a gentler way of explaining it would be that the two planets merge. It usually happens in an irregular galaxy, and examples might include the Whirlpool Galaxy and the Mice Galaxies. It's not the same as galactic collision, where galaxies collide but they don't change shape. Junk in the trunk. Currently, Earth has roughly 8,000 objects floating around it, and it is all junk. Leftovers from spacecraft that's just floating about with nowhere better to go. Which of these incredible facts do you find the most mind-blowing? Share your thoughts with us in the comments below. 1. Mystery Solved we mentioned the Hubble telescope earlier on in the video, and this incredible telescope has solved the mystery of the strange bulge in the middle of the Milky Way. Usually, the Milky Way appears as a relatively flat structure, but gamma ray emissions show a different image. It displays two massive structures that look like an hourglass. Known as the Fermi Bubbles, it's been confirmed that it's the Milky Way's black hole sucking up interstellar gas in the past. The structures are believed to have formed 6 million to 9 million years ago, and since then, the black hole has just been gorging itself non-stop. 